What's up, family? This is your girl, Blue Nola, back in the building with another reading. I hope all is well in your world. So tonight, we're going to focus our attention specifically on Patrick Xavier Clark, the man who was recently indicted for Takeoff's murder, okay? Now, when this news went out, I think it was yesterday or the day before, I saw a lot of comments in the comment section like, he didn't do it, he's the fall guy, they have the wrong person, this is not who he is. So for me, I just wanted to like, that's interesting that they keep saying this. Is he he's, is he the guy? Like, do they have it right? I mean, because a lot of people seem to be vouching for this guy, right? So, first and foremost, we want to send our condolences out once again to take off family. And I know I have to only imagine how they feel about getting this news about, you know, there's some progression in this case. But do they have it right? Because, again, a lot of people seem to be defending this guy, uh, Patrick Xavier Clark. Okay? Um, Big Up Houston. How y'all doing? Welcome to the channel, everybody. I hope all is well again. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to comment. And don't forget to subscribe. All right? Let's get into this reading. Again, this is going to be specifically on Patrick Xavier Clark. Nothing else and nothing more. Do they have the right person? Now, what we're going to do, since the trial is beginning, we're going to create a playlist. I have several readings already, but we're going to create a playlist for um, for takeoff, okay? And this playlist will be specifically on the case. Tonight, I am using the uh, Gilded Tarot, beautiful deck. This is a new deck. I always use this one. I probably have like about 12, 15 decks of this, right? I love this deck. We are also using, which I've already added here, Dragon Blood in a liquid, liquid form and some Conjure Oil. All right. You can use this, uh, especially when you're doing spells, petitions. Um, I use it sometimes even when I'm chanting. You can use this. You can add it to your, you know, your, your, of course, your wax part of your candle and let that burn out. And it's okay as long as you do it that way. Okay. In our ritual bowl we are burning oh i think i'm doing prosperity powder tonight i did prosperity powder all right so this is one you can also use and again you can get all these things from amazon child take a look at it and um hey you know do your thing so let's go ahead and get into it so again our focus tonight is patrick xavier clark been indicted by a grand jury in Houston for sh shooting incident of takeoff. Did he do it? Do they have inf enough information to really convict him? Do they have it wrong? Is Patrick Xavier Clark the fall guy? What is the energy around Patrick Xavier Clark as it relates to the death of Legal's wrapper take off. Three of Pentacles. Three of Wands. The Devil card. King of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. Four of Wands. Sun card. He has the Page of Wands. In the Empress. Let me say this. Um, first and foremost, he was there. It's here. I didn't watch all everything that happened with it. Again, it was triggering for me. A lot of y'all know that from watching my videos. But Patrick Xavier Clark was actually at the function. It shows it here in his Three of Pentacles energy. This talks about he was a part of the festivities, a part of the situation. He was being investigated because he was actually there, etc., etc. He also has his energy. They have been watching him in his Three of Wands energy. This talks about his. they expanded their search. The search quickly focused on him. He became their goal. They feel like he was the person. They feel that he was the person who created this situation. This talks about somebody who did something impulsive, right? Actually, the double card could represent in Capricorn energy. And I'm not, I'm just, I'm not saying it's everything, but this is violence, all right? Also, he has the King of Pentacles in his energy. This represents somebody who did something excessive. This also represents somebody who did something dangerous. 
And this represents somebody who created peril for someone or fear. All right. He also has in his energy the nine of wands in here. This talks about they have it right, guys. I mean, I'm sorry for the people of Houston who thinks he's not the person. That nine of wands is in his energy. This talks about taking, you know, once they really get through the case, you'll hear a lot of information about who Patrick Clark really is, what his real background is, what he really was doing. Uh, this is what it talks about. They have supporting information, supported data, um, and documentation. Remember they said the audio surveillance, physical evidence, it's to talk about the weapon, and then they're talking about uh, maybe other people who could corroborate. I do feel like they've gotten a little further in terms of getting some people to corroborate or just getting some information. And his sun card energy here, this is talking about a lot of people are going to be divided. Again, some people are going to feel like conspiracy, right? Some people are going to feel like the government did it. Some people are going to feel like they said, you know, this was Jay Prince. This is like somebody who just was randomly shooting into me. When you see that King of Pentacles, that's somebody who's just acting excessively for, you know, over the top energy. Uh, somebody who, you know, and remember they said it was a lucrative card game. This could be something happening with the card game or some argument over money. Because notice in the first two positions, and, and it, there's some money that's here, right? I'm going to say it like this. I feel that this is the right person. Even in this page of Wands energy, this talks about the police themselves doing their due diligence. They don't, they don't just have him, and they don't just have him for no reason. The page of Wands represents message, message, good news, exploration of information, the right person. Somebody that they continue to focus on and focus on and focus on, right? Um, if I were Patrick Clark, I would take a plea deal if they offered it. The Empress is in reverse. The Empress could be considered someone who did something excessive. Again, remember excessive, excessive, unintentional, right? It wasn't something... It, it almost feels like something that was like a bad situation, a crazy situation that happened. And this is why you have the sun card here, because that sun card represents something that people just didn't expect to happen. It just is like almost like, and this is why I'm going to tell y'all, getting into arguments with people about dice, about politics, about anything, that can get dicey. And this is what this represents. Um... That sun card could represent people starting to get into it and then things turning negative. Ego, egos being bruised. And then people just feeling real, real like, real, like real cocky with it. The thing that I see here is ego, negativity, danger, excessive, right? Violence. There's a whole lot going on here in this thing. And for anybody that feels like the police don't have this right, you might want to think again. See how those boys that went down for the XX Tentacion case, they had they tracked their uh, footsteps through surveillance, through this, through that, through that. They're doing that exact same thing to Patrick Clark. They have the right person. So we're going to follow this case. And I believe, in my opinion, that it definitely was unexpected. I feel like I do feel like takeoff is in the wrong place at the wrong time because there's a lot of excessive energy in here and unexpected energy. The sun card is something that's unexpected, right? Unexpectedly happened. So something that somebody did excessively, people could have been drinking and going crazy and partying. This feels unexpected. Was pay takeoff a target or was this just a random act spirit? Give me the energy around takeoff. What's ooh? And the musician is here, right? The musician is here. Let's keep going. Was takeoff the target or was it unexpected? That, that represents that guy. He's not telling the truth about everything. That musician. He wasn't the target, guys. Because in his ace of cups. And his ace of swords. That's positive energy. And meaning that he wasn't the target. If you saw this and this, like anybody that reads tarot, then he would have been a target. 
that would have mean, meant that that brutal that 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 chaos was meant for him that pursuit was meant for him that brutality was meant for him that danger was meant for him in that ace of cups their false intentions was meant for him that bad intention was meant for him that bullet was meant for him but he's in positive energy for that so i don't feel like he was an intended target so You'll hear that as well through the trial because he is coming up, even though he was harmed in this situation, in his energy, he is an innocent bystander. We're going to follow the case as it starts to unfold. I'm going to re-release this. I'm going to launch it again so you can see it again. But he wasn't the person that was intended. This feels very, again, there's a lot of excessive and sporadic energy here. All right. How does... Take off his family feel about Patrick Xavier Clark being indicted. Do they feel, spirit, does the family feel that this is the right guy? And they're in mourning still. Right? But they're looking at they feel like he they making the right decision. Their this family is this is still the loss, the grief, the mourning, the dark period. This is what this talks about, right? Family still in mourning. Ten of Wands. They feel like he is the person. They are stressed. They feel he is the one that caused harm to take off. Period. So, they're going to let the system do what he needs to do. <clears throat> More information to come. Again, this is specifically on Patrick Clark. So, this is what I think we should do. We can do specifically Patrick Clark. I think there was a second man involved with this too. Specifically that guy. Specifically anybody. I want to do specifics because when you, it's so many moving parts to it. It just can get muddled. Oh, last question. Will this guy Patrick Clark be convicted? Will he get any jail time for the situation? Will he his trial be successful will he get jail time will they have a mistrial what's the energy around it because they be having some cases not be mistrial what's the energy around patrick clark as it relates to this case this trial being indicted will he get any time or will he be released patrick and xavier clark queen of cops that's his lawyer she feels confident that he didn't do it two of pentacles she feels confident that he did not do it. Four of Cups. He didn't do this. This is what she's saying. This is his lawyer speaking. She's fighting for his freedom to be released. He got a good lawyer, y'all. He got a good lawyer. So the Queen of Cups is his lawyer fighting for him. That Two of Pentacles is her creating a lot of reasonable doubt. There's a lot of energy around people almost like, you know what, this almost makes me feel like he has a good chance with this lady lawyer. He really does have a good chance with this lady lawyer because this talks about almost like creating a lot of reasonable doubt in, in the minds of people, right? Um, remember, the police don't have a whole lot of actual witnesses. They had to chase this down through, you know, a lot of like, you know, um, you know, strategic chasing it down so this lawyer is going to be good at trying to create a lot of reasonable doubt in the minds of people a lot of people are going to be divided into what this is this is going to trial she has a good a good uh what do you want to call it um a good response to what's happening she's going to do a lot of like laying the facts out in good faith She's going to start off by saying, I will, in this case, you will know reason why he did not do this. This is what it talks about, right? <clears throat> She's going to be doing pretty well, but in his nine of swords, ultimately, this talks about the verdict. The verdict could be like, ultimately, he should just take a plea deal because even with her laying out all the facts, she's a really good lawyer. This is his lawyer. It feels like he can still have some sort of restriction on him. I use restriction now because the restrictions could look different ways. All right. 
But when I say y'all gonna be like looking like, oh damn, he might not go to jail. <laughs> like he might, they might like let this man out. Like towards the end of this case, it won't be enough to save him. That's what it looks like to me. And his nine of swords, that's still somebody who can get some type of judgment. If you remember, you have the card of judgment in the beginning. Confirm the energy around Patrick Xavier Clark. The final outcome for him, spirit. The seven of cups. It will be decided by the jurors. They will come up with a decision. <clears throat> and the judge, Patrick Xavier Clark, final decision, isolation. So again, it's not set in stone, but it feels like his lawyer is going to do a really great job. Like we're going to be biting our fingernails. If I were Patrick Clark, <laughs> Patrick Xavier Clark, I would really think about my involvement and then really putting me in the, um, putting me in, putting me with this case. This and, and it looks like he is. I would literally take a plea down. All right, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. We can do specific people to this case. I'm gonna create a playlist for takeoff. And thank you so much. Have a great day. Don't forget you can book your appointment at BlueNotaTarot.com. Peace and blessings. Bye.